Mm -hmm. so before you jump in, um, we're going, uh, there was a PDF that was sent over to you by email that Brian will, uh, will be using after the PowerPoint. Okay. So just open that up after the PowerPoint. Um, let me check. And on the PDF, I'll be starting at page 13. Um, page 13, okay, I saw it. Um, I'm gonna also open it just in case. Okay. Okay, I have it opened. Okay, it's open on my side now. You said page 13, right? Yes, page 13. Yeah, it should be the first screenshot of the application. Yes, I got it. Okay. So we're gonna just start now, okay. Uh, okay, let's see. Okay, that's how Okay, uh, Okay, Entrepreneur Works, uh, the Brian Rank, right? Am I right? Yes, that's right. OK,啊,就是麻煩大家精英,OK,一個背景,啊,應該每一個君來都是精英的,OK,最最後的時候就是啊,大家可以舉手啊,啊,如果在這個期間有問題的話可以再聊天裡面把你的問題記錄下來,
OK， 他们是啊，等一下 ，OK， just wait， sorry， I'm just doing one thing。OK， 他们是啊、呃，在泉州里边来啊，有十八个机构 ，OK， 是可以去管理这个贷款的 ，OK， 这个补助的啊，他们是其中一员。I will share、uh, an overview of the grant program, and then we'll take a few minutes to actually look at the application, and then have some time at the end for questions. 它会就是很啊，就是一个大概的，去让大家知道这个补助金的计划是怎么样。也他呀，到最后也会看一看这个申请表是怎么填的，然后到最后就是一个问答。This is a statewide grant program for small businesses. Ah,、uh, it's it's federal funds, ah,、uh, from the CARES Act that the state is using to support. Small businesses across the state of Pennsylvania. Okay, this is a state-funded grant from the CARES Act. This is a state-funded grant from the CARES Act. The program is being managed by community development financial institutions (CDFIs). There are eighteen CDFIs. Entrepreneur Works is one of them. Okay, this program is ah, 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 So a little bit about Entrepreneur Works. We are a, a nonprofit, community-based organization in Philadelphia with the mission of、um, helping communities through supporting small businesses. Okay. Um, it is. They are Entrepreneur Works. Yeah, is a very small city organization in Philadelphia. Okay, it is. Ah, their mission is to help small businesses. Ah, 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 is to help small businesses. And also through business training and some one-on-one -on -one business coaching. Okay, ah, he is saying they have three things to help. First, is to help small businesses with the loan. Okay, they are loaning five thousand dollars or more. Okay, they also have a business training program to help small businesses with the loan. Okay, they also have a business training program to help small businesses with the loan. Okay, they also have a business training program to help small businesses with the loan. Over the past few months,、uh, due to、um, the impact of COVID, we've been spending a lot of time helping our clients and small businesses access resources, grant programs, and other resources、uh, to help keep their businesses going and now to help reopen their businesses. Okay. 他说，过去因为疫情的话，他们就是帮助那些小企业，就是去怎么可以拿到，就是怎么可以去拿到这些补助啊？有什么资源呢、啊？怎么可以拿到这些补助？然后就是可以让他的这个小企业可以啊，再啊继续下去啊。然后也是现在因为重开了，也是帮助这些小企业怎么可以重开。And next slide. <coughs> So the COVID relief、uh, PA statewide small business assistance grant.、Um, th these are the the basics、uh, to be eligible. You must be located. The business must be located in Pennsylvania. You can live outside of Pennsylvania, but the business must be physically located in the state of Pennsylvania, and certified to do business in the state. And if you have、um, a business that works in multiple states, you must be generating at least fifty-one percent of your revenue from Pennsylvania. Okay. If you want to apply for this Pennsylvania's small business assistance grant, first, you must be located in Pennsylvania. 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 
，OK 啊、uh, ，然后还有要得到有牌照去做这个生意的，然后就是如果你是在你的商业是在不同的州的话 ，OK， 你必须要五十一个 percent 的收入都是在宾州的这个啊生意里边。The this grant program recognizes that、um, many small businesses, like very small and, and family businesses. Um, are an incredible, important resource to our communities, and、um, they have suffered a lot during this time. So, the focus of the program is really on small businesses. Ah,、uh, 然后就是这个主要就是帮助哪些可能是小生意啊，家庭生意啊，因为他们这些就是这个市区的啊、uh, 根本。OK， 所以他们这个啊、uh, 补助主要就是给哪些就是小生意的。So the the business must、um, have one million in revenue or less,、uh, an annual revenue. If it's more than one million, you're not eligible, and also have twenty five or less employees. Okay, this ah, is must be ah, net income must not be more than one million dollars, one million yuan. If your net income is more than one million dollars, you are not eligible. 然后还有你的员工在二月呃十五号之前不可以有多于二十五个全职的员工。那平时一百万。啊、哦，一百万，我说错了。<笑> OK、um,。对。I know there's a there's a question about um whether independent contractors qualify. I'm I'm not sure the answer to that question. I think um what I would say is the business um has to be. Uh, a business and be registered in Pennsylvania. He is saying there is a problem. He is saying that those who are self-employed, okay, do, uh, self-employed contractors, can they be eligible for this? Ah, he is not sure about this answer. Ah, but the main focus is on those who are self-employed. Ah, who are self-employed and have a license in Pennsylvania. Ah, do business. So you saying like you're not sure, or um, you're sure that it's just for、uh, people physically located. Um, so, uh, I I would say, um, if it's an independent contractor, um,、mm-hmm. and you're you're registered as like a sole proprietor or LLC, I think you would qualify. You would be eligible.、Mm-hmm. 他说：“如果你是独立的承包商，如果你是看你怎么登记，如果你登记是 sole proprietor， 还有 LLC 的话，你有可能就是可以啊，可以申请。Uh, ”I'm just going to jump in real quick.、Um, yeah, jump in. I would like us、uh, maybe just so、uh, we have the ability to go through the whole presentation. We'll wait until the very end、um, of everything, and then we'll go for questions.、Mm-hmm. That sounds good. All right, next slide. Ah, they are saying all the problems. We can, ah, yes, just now, ah, just ah, teaching Brian, just can put all the problems, just leave it to the end. We will answer. Okay, yes, go ahead. Okay, so we will start with the first one. Yes, go ahead. So, um, these are the the eligible grant amounts. The size of the grant or the the amount that you may be eligible for is based on the annual revenue of your business. Okay, ah,、uh, this is just saying the grant amount. This is okay. This is based on the annual revenue of your business. Okay, this is based on the annual revenue of your business. Okay, this is based on the annual revenue of your business. Okay, this is based on the annual revenue of your business. Okay, this is based on the annual revenue of your So, if on your most recent tax return,、um, for example, you had eighty-five thousand in revenue, then you can look at this chart and you would fall、um, on the third line at, with the fifteen thousand. 他说，如果你的年收入是八万五千块钱的话，你就是第三行。Okay, so you are the one who has to take one million five hundred thousand. And、uh, later, I will show you where to find、um, the application instructions, which also includes this chart. Okay, 拓展一下，我教你是怎么去找到这个申请表，然后里边也有这一个表。Right, next slide. 
Um, so the use of the funds, uh, the grant can must be used for costs related to COVID-19. Um, so and and it's very um it's very broad, kind of generous scope of expenses or costs or losses related to COVID-19. Okay, so it can cover payroll costs or mortgage or other debt interest. It can't cover um, debt principal, but it can cover uh, debt interest payments. Uh,就是第一就是个个工资成本是可以啊啊可以用的，OK，你也可以用来这个啊这个贷款利息的，OK，还是你的那些债务的利息，可是它不可以就是帮你付这个本金。So okay? cover rent payments, utilities, uh, other overhead costs. OK，啊就是房租啊、水电费啊，然后还有就是其他的有一些开支。and it can also be used for working capital or expenses related to reopening your business. Yeah. Um, so mm -hmm. if you need to buy like PPE supplies, masks, those kinds of things for your employees, or you need to make adjustments to your shop, um, it can cover those costs as well. Okay. 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 Got received another grant for, so you can't double dip. So, if you received money from the city of Philadelphia, or the SBA, or another grant, um, you can still apply for the program, but you cannot um, use two grants for the same expense. Yeah,他就是说你不可以说double-dip,基本上就是说如果你已经申请过死政府的,OK,也好好,有可能是SBA里边的这个IDO还是PPP的话了,OK,你边说你用来做什么的话,你就不可以再用这一个去用同一样的
，OK， 所以有的这些啊材料就是为了就是避免这些啊就是诈骗。And then you also need your bank account information, um, and that will be verified to make sure the bank account is active and and does belong to you and your business. 然后你也需要银行账户的资料，他们会证实这个有没有这个账户，这个账户是不是啊这个商业的。Right, next slide. So the application is online. We、um, are working with a a、um, national、uh, organization, a community lender called Lendistry, to manage our application for us. You said what's the organization's name? Lendistry. Lendistry. Yeah. Lendistry. Correct. Okay. 啊、uh, ，他们就是啊， uh, 跟一个啊， uh, 另外一个机构合作，叫 Community Lend， 啊、uh, ，是一个社区的啊，贷、uh, 款的，他们叫啊、uh, ，Lendistry。The application is in two parts. The first part is the actual application, and then when you complete the actual application and submit it, you will receive a verification email with、um, steps to log back in to upload the required documents. OK， 就是这个申请是两个程序的。第一就是你要完成这个申请表。当你提交了这个申请表的话，它有一个验证的 email 发给你，然后里边就有说你怎么去重新再进去这个申请去上载一些文件。Ping， are you able to select that link that I have there, the pabusinessgrants.com? Ah,、uh, yes. Um, it is loading. And I can just Um, share everyone very quickly this page. I think it is opening. Let me see. Well, if not, I would just do this.、Um, I will also mention the application、um, is open right now until July fourteenth. This is the first、um, window for applying. And then it will close, and we will review the applications, and then it, the application will open again for the second round, probably sometime in August. I don't think we have the dates yet. So can you say that? Um, so it's open now until July thirteenth. July fourteenth. Fourteenth. Okay. And then,、uh -huh. and then it will close, and we will review、um, all the the applications that have, people have applied in the first round,、mm -hmm. and then there will be a second round. That will open probably in August. Okay. He is saying now is the first round. Okay, is now already can apply until July 14th. Okay, and then they will close. Close when they close. They will review the applications and review the documents. Okay, and then they will close. Close when they close. They will review the applications and review the documents. Okay, and then they will close. Close when they close. They will review the applications and review the documents. Okay, and then they will close. Close when they close. They will review the applications and review the documents. Okay, and then they will close. Close when they close. They will review the applications and review the documents. Okay, and then they will close. Close when they close. They will review Um, it has all the information that you need on this、um, on this website. If you scroll down a little bit,、mm, just one second. I am trying to make sure. Oh, thank you, Lai Mei. I was about to do that. Okay. Great. Thank you. Okay, Lai Mei. Ah, ah, 对他啊，莱梅他刚刚把这个网站发在这个聊天里边了，所以你们可以看一下。Um, so Brian, I I know I'm gonna scroll down. Oh,、uh, I just want to make sure people know there's a translate button. I don't know what language is translated. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Uh, I can't even tell which one is Chinese. <laughs> And、okay. I haven't tried it, so I don't know how well it works. Oh, okay, see, okay, 就是想呃，就是让 Brian 之前我看到这个网上有一个 translate button. Okay, so something's wrong. It's like if people don't know understand English, they would not know that translate button. Ah, right. Thank you. Okay, so、yes. if you can somehow maybe I don't know.、Uh, I think usually people put a robo in them. People can recognize. Okay. Okay. Ah,、uh, 就是想跟大家说，其实可以翻译成中文的。它右上角有一个 translate button. Okay. So translate 就是中文的，英文的意思就是说翻译。Okay. 然后我我看到是这个是中文啊。哦、oh, ，Okay. So you can 你可以把这个 mouse 放在上面，你就可以知道它是什么语言了、啊。我刚才找不到中国国旗。Okay. 现在找到了。Okay. 中文。Okay. So let me see. Okay, so so they can be translated into Chinese. Okay, good. Actually, so if you scroll down just a little bit, but before I scroll down, let me translate it back to English first because、okay. 
we all don't understand. Okay, good. Okay. okay. Yes. Mm -hmm. um, so this has a lot of the great information um, about the grant. If you scroll down right there, you'll see under the instructions, um, there are the application instructions. It's recommended that you use Google Chrome. The application works the best in Google Chrome, um, if possible. And do not submit more than one application um, because it, it will duplicate applications, um, will, will cause an, an issue uh, with um, processing them. Um, but then you'll see several links they're okay, under additional tools and resources. Brian, just one second. Oh, yes. Okay. 他说你下来的话, 他在有一个, 如果中文发音应该是个个, uh, 几次吧, okay? 然后下边也有不同的材料，他说最好是用Google there are the application instructions and frequently asked questions. Um, and if you select the application instructions, we can go there. Okay. So this is the one. Um, and then if you scroll to page 13. Yes. Great, here we go. So the first page of the application will look like this. You will start with the the new application button, the apply now. apply now, just If you already did the first part and you submitted the application, then you will come back to this page to sign in with your email and password to upload the required documents. Okay, Okay, And on the right under qualifications, you'll see a list of required documentation. On the very bottom is the link application certification. 他说在右手边这里是qualification就是资格 OK,在这里,它为上面有些需要什么文件 最下边有一个application certification就是这个申请印证 So at the, the, after applying, you will be asked to upload um, First of all, you will download the application certification And it will um, have a few places for you to sign Verifying that the information you submitted is correct and you will use the funds for COVID related expenses and so forth. Um, and then after signing, you will upload that document with the other documents. So Ryan, I just want to clarify. So yes. do they click on this application certification after they submit the application before they upload or after they upload? Um, you, can, you can download it anytime. Um, in fact, if you select it now, we can take a look at what it looks like. I don't think I can select it now. Oh, yeah, that's right. You can't select it in the, the PDF. Well, actually, can I actually um, let me go back here? Uh, I'm sure this should be on this website, right? Yeah, if you go there. So if you start the application, it'll give you a list of counties. Okay, okay. okay. And then it will give a list of all the organizations in Philadelphia. And these are all CDFIs that are working together um, to implement and promote uh, this grant program. So if you apply through Entrepreneur Works, you can click Start Your Application. And it'll take a second to load, and then you'll see this page. Okay. Okay. And I'll mention two things while we're here. One, if you have questions, 
you can contact where it says contact entrepreneur works. There's an email you, address and phone number. This will go to the Lendistry support team and they can help you with um, any issues related to the application. Okay, and at the end of the presentation, I will also give you my direct email, so you can contact me as well. And here you can see the application certification link. Okay. And um, if you download it, it will give you this, this page with a lot of fine print. Again, because these are government funds, we just have to make sure that everybody is um, signing off, saying that they will... The information is correct and they will use the funds um, according to the grant for, for COVID relief. Okay, uh, application okay. 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 And then um, after signing this, at the end of the application, there will be a place where you can upload it along with your tax returns and wow. other documents. Oh, okay. So this is just addition, uh, one of the documents that they need to complete yeah. and then upload at the same time. Yeah. Um, okay. Sometimes it can be confusing because uh, people don't know where to find it. Oh, okay. Um, you find it here on the main application. Yeah, I, think, I, I feel like a lot of people will be missing that. It is true. Yeah, a lot of people are missing. Okay, right. 他就, okay uh, let me translate. So, Tadosu, okay, Trader Gansa, I show the Tian Biao, Sansai Wan Jian. Okay, they got application certification, they got a Sansai Yan Zing. Okay, yeah, Su, Shu Yao Sansai. So, you can't tell that they see you let the girl Biao Gur, Shu Yao the Dong Su, Jiho Yu application certification, it just Shu Yao Shazai. 你要填好了,然後當你上載這些文件的時候,你也把這一個一起上載上去。Alright, let's go back to um, the application instructions where we have screenshots of the application. Mm -hmm. And then um, we can move through this fairly quickly just to give everyone an idea of what the application looks like. Okay,我就是說我去這裡,這樣大家可以看一些這個申請表就是裡邊有什麼資料。So we we'll ask for um, your basic contact information and you can um you don't have to but you can check the box for uh receive text message updates about your application. Scroll down the next page. And it will ask for information of who owns the business. Um, if there's a second owner, you can fill in that information as well. Okay. 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 Um, and then you will enter the actual business information, the name of the business, um, what you know, type of business it is. Okay, and how the third one, the uh, is to enter the business information, the business name, okay, and how is the business name? You can scroll to the next page. Okay, and here is where you put in um, how much you're asking for in the grant, and um, you can select check eligibility. There's a link you'll see on the right. Um, you probably can access it in this PDF, but that check eligibility will bring up the same chart that we looked at earlier. Okay. 
，OK， 你是就就,就在右手边 check eligibility， 你就是可以安进去。他就刚才我们看的那个表就在里边的。And you can scroll down the next one. Here it shows you if you check eligibility, it'll show you the chart. OK， 就是这里就是说你就是刚才按了之后，你可以看到这个表格。And if if you make a mistake and you put in、um, too large an amount,、um, it it will not make you ineligible. What they will do is, when the application is reviewed, they will put down、um, a lower amount for what you're actually eligible for based on your your most、okay. recent tax return. He said, if you write wrong, okay, write too much. OK， 他们不会因为这些多了就拒绝你的申请，他就是会就是可能把这个啊、uh, 金额就是调整。Uh, this has more information、uh, requested about your business。这个就是问一些更多的资料关于你的这个商店的。If you don't know your NAICS code, you can do a a search. Um, if you go, I forget what the website is, but if you go do a Google search for the NICS, you can look up、um, your industry. Okay. Ah,、uh, so oh, you mean the NAICS code? Yes, correct. Okay. So you're saying, ah,、uh, if they actually go to Google and search that, they can, um, ah,、uh, if they yes, if they search that. Oh, actually, there's also a click here, right? Oh yeah, there you go. Yeah, that might give you some. That that might let you search on that way. Then there is a code. Some people don't know what the NAICS code is. It's behind a link. You can click on it, and then it will give you a link. Then you can click on it, and then it will give you a link. Then you can click on it, and then it will give you a link. Then you can click on it, and then it will give you a link. Then you can click on it, and then it will give you a link. Then you can click on it, and then it will give you a link. Then you can click on it, and then it will give you a link. Then you can click on it, and then it will give you a link. Then you can click on it, and then So this is the. Okay, this is just.、Um, yeah, so that'll just help you find your、um, code for your industry. Okay, 这里就是说不一不不同种类的啊、uh, 商业都在里边的。Okay. And then、um, there'll be a page with disclosures.、Um, I guess again, just、um, uh, verifying some information here. OK， 这里就是一个披露，就是说主要就是证明一些啊你自己的资料。And here is where you'll need to know、um, what your revenue was、uh, March through May for 2019 and 2020. 就这这里就是需要你填你是三月到五月的你的收入是多少，你就需要填进去。All right, you can scroll down to the next one. And you can you'll submit the application then, and then you'll receive this confirmation. Ah,、uh, 你提交了之后，你就会啊、uh, 收到这一个确认。And then you'll want to go check your email, and you can scroll on down. 然后你就是去收到这个，你就去查你的 email. So you'll receive an email confirmation. At this point, you've completed the first、uh, part of the application process. Okay, you will receive. That is, is say you ah, is complete the first part. Okay. You will be given a, a username and a temporary password. That is, give you a temporary password and a password. And then,、um, if you click that button, you'll be able to log back in. Then, click the green button, you can log in and create a new password. Then, you need to log in and create a new password. You can scroll down, and it's important that you you after submitting an application, you log back in to upload your documents. 他说非常重要，就是你完成申请表的话，你要在登录中去把你的文件上载。You go in, you select upload documents and bank information. 你进去之后了，你这里就是说有一个按钮，就是说啊，上载这个文件还有银行资料。And scroll down. Okay, so then here,、um, this is what you'll see. There will be. It, it'll ask what type of business you have. It will ask you what type of business you have. It will ask you what type of business you have. It will ask you what type of business you have. It will ask you what type of business you have. It will ask you what type of business you have. It will ask you what type of business you have. It will ask you what type of business you have. It will ask you what type of business you have. It will ask you what type of business you have. It will ask you what type of business you have. It will ask you what type of business you have. It will ask you what type of business you have. It will ask you what type of business you
啊，就是你可能是啊是什么绿营的商业是 LLC 啦，啊 Super Power 啊，还是啊还是啊，我忘记是什么了。Okay, yes. Okay, and then um, it'll it'll give a list of documents that are required to upload. 啊，然后根据你选的话，它就会有一个表，就是说你需要上载什么文件。And Peng, are you able to zoom in just a little bit? Okay. Okay, so you'll see on this list there are some documents that may not apply to you. For example,、um, it says proof of tax payment plan, but if your taxes are current, there's no need to submit a tax payment plan. Okay, ah, 这个列表里边可能有一些是你不需要不使使用的 Okay, 就在里边有一个 proof of tax payment plan, 就是说证明你是啊分期付款这个啊税 Okay, 啊可是如果你没有欠税的话，你就没有这一个了 So, um, you can either just let that blank, or you can take a blank sheet of paper, a, a blank file, and just say. Uh, my taxes are current, and upload that. Okay. If you don't have it, you can just ignore it. 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 Okay, scroll on down a bit.、Um, and this will just show you a little bit more detail about how to upload your documents. This is just show, just is 教你怎么去上载文件 Okay, I think you might want to. I think it's on the right that um, if it's all completed, right? Right. Yes. Okay. Ah, 就是说你啊，如果你全部上载之后了，你这个文文件列表了，就是说 complete， 就是录制的。You scroll on down. The last step will be linking your bank account. 最后一呃，最后一个步啊，就是需要去连接你的银行。So here, um, they're actually showing you how to create a blank PDF. Um, so for example. The example they're giving there is you can just say this document does not apply to me and upload that. Oh, he just says, if you have the document is not there, you just need to according to what he says, this document does not apply to our business. That is to say, this one document is not in our business. Our business is not in our business. It is not required for this document. You just click on it. Then you just yes. And then, then okay. So do you also want the title to be saying not applicable to business? Um, that's fine. Yeah. Or does it matter, or it doesn't matter? It doesn't matter. Okay. Yeah. Ah, you are not. He just here. He just is saying you don't have to put this document on the document. It's all done. It's all done. It's not applicable to business. I just asked him. He said he doesn't need this title. Okay, this name is not necessary. Okay. Yeah, it doesn't matter if how they say it. Um, this is not necessary. Okay. So the final step then is to link your bank account. 啊，最后一个步骤就是去连接你的银行啊账户。And this information will be used for two things. One, um, Lendistry uses a secure, uh, online, um, company to verify that your bank account is, um, is current and matches you or your business to, um, check for fraud. Okay, 第一部分呢，它就是这个 Lendistry 呢，他们是用一个网上安非常安全的网上啊、呃、公司，他们就是连接到啊、呃，就是去确认这个银行是不是存在的。Okay， 这个银行是不是真的是这个人的 ？They um do not store or do anything with your username or password or bank information. Okay, they don't store your bank records, and they don't store your bank account number and phone number. And then in step two,、um, where you put in your bank information and routing number, account number, that will be used to、uh, deposit the funds if you are awarded the grant. 
第二步就是说啊，你的这个银行的资料这样子，如果是真的批了你的话，它钱就自动转账在里边。Can I also just ask you? So when you say link the bank, so which mean? Uh, does that mean that uh, they have to put their maybe online banking information to verify? Correct. Yes. And if they do not have the online banking information,、mm -hmm. um, they can skip this step and only do step two.、Mm -hmm. And someone from Lendistry、mm -hmm. will、um, contact them. Okay. 啊、uh, ，我刚才就是问他，就算第一步的话啦，他们用这个说、so、link your bank 就是去连接你的银行，去证明有没有这个银行，还有是不是这个人的。他的办法就是说，可能需要你就是一个，你如果你有网上银行的话，你就是可能要啊、呃，就是打你的用户名跟密码，就是登录进去，这样子就可以呃连接到你的银行。OK， 所以他说他不会就是取传你的啊、呃、用户名跟密码。OK， 它只是就是验证有这个银行，因为你是没有网上银行的话，你可以不做 Step One， 不做第一步，你就就直接把你的银行资料打进去。有他们这样子的话，他们这个 Industry 的员工就是需要他们人手的去验证这个银行全部存在，可能就是比较可能需要长一点的时间。So I would assume it would take longer time, right? If they don't complete Step One, right? Um, it may take a little bit more. Time because someone will need to contact you,、okay. um, but they they don't need to worry about it.、Um, okay. I I would just emphasize that if any documents are missing or incorrect, or the bank account is not linked, someone from the team at Lundustry will contact them、uh, to verify information and to request any missing information. OK， 他我刚才就是问他，如果不做第一步的话，是不是就是要长一点时间？他说可能需要多一点点，因为他的员工需要联系你去啊、呃、完成这些步骤。OK， 就是可是他也说了啊、呃，如果你的申请表上面有什么是不太正确呀，就是有问题的话，他们这个员工，他们的员工都是会联系你去啊、呃、问更多的资料。Okay. Yeah, so your application will still be reviewed, but they will reach out to you for anything that is missing. 他说你的申请表不为，因为就是啊漏了一些资料，然啊然后就不处理，他们还是会联系你去啊去做的。So after this section, you can select save and close. 啊，然后完成之后，你就是可以 save and close， 可以就是取传，然后关闭就可以了。And then that's the end of the application. 然后就完成这个啊申请。After you upload your documents and and link your bank account, you do not receive any confirmation. Okay, so you say after they link the bank account and upload, they do not receive any confirmation. They do not. You can just click save and close. Okay. And okay. Now that your application is complete. OK， 他就是说，如果你完成这个上载还有银行的连接的话，他是不会再发 email 给你说完成的。OK， 啊、uh, ，因为他应该是可以用密码这个，就是可以再进去就可以看到你的资料有没有上传。Yeah， because I think it because the accounts， 啊、uh, ， they can still log back in with the username and password to see if the completed， right？ That's correct. Yes. 对，你可以用这个啊，他、uh, 给你的这个用户名跟密码，再再进去看看你的资料有没有完整。OK. Okay, let's. I know we only have a few minutes left, but I definitely want to、um, have some time for questions. OK. 他说啊，我们还有几分钟，可是他就是想啊，看看大家有没有什么问题。OK. Um, Brian, I'm just going to relay some questions we have in the chat box. Yes.、Uh, one question we had was. What you've already addressed was、um, so if businesses don't have online banking, they can just、uh, they don't have to link their online banking, but they will need to do step two and then be contacted by Lendistry, correct? That's correct. Yes.、Okay. Yeah. So linking the bank account makes it easier for us to、um, verify that the bank account is is、um, legal and just have a second、um, way of. Of avoiding any fraud,、mm -hmm. um, but if they don't link the account,、mm -hmm. um, your application will still be reviewed, and Lendistry will just contact you if any additional information is needed. Okay. All right. Thank you.
OK 啊，刚才的问题就是说，呃、uh, ，OK， wait， let me try to think， I'm not that tired. Ah， let me. What's the questions? 呃，他的问题刚才有人就是说，要是没有网网络的这个银行的呃账户的话，呃，那怎么办呢？然后呢，我就重复了一遍刚才阿平翻译的意思，就是说，你要是没有银行网络的那个网上的账户的话，你可以就是不用提交这个信息，但是呢，你还是得需要填你的那个账户的信息，然后呢，到时候提交完了以后，他们那个。这个 industry 呢会跟你联系。嗯，对。Okay. And then we had a another question regarding um what what is considered an entity document? Um, is that something like when the company was formed, the document was that? Um, yes. So it's really any um. So the entity document. Would it would be a document that you received when the when the、um, business was created? If you filed it with the state of Pennsylvania, for example, when you file and, and register a LLC, you'll receive、um, uh, I think it's called formation certification or something like that.、Um, and if you if you registered your business a long time ago. And you don't know where to find those documents, but you know you're registered with the state of Pennsylvania. You can actually、um, do a search with Pennsylvania. Okay.、Uh, let, I can, if you want to translate that, then I'll explain how to、yes. how to search、okay. your business. Okay. Ah,、uh, 刚呃就是有一个问题说哦、uh, ，就是这个 entity document OK 是什么了？是是不是公司成立的这个证明文件 OK？ 它就是说。OK， 啊啊，就是应该是你登记的时候有一个叫 formation certification， 就是可能啊 formation 就是九成的这个证明。OK， 他说如果是很久很久以前的这个商业，你的商业如果是很久以前的话呢，你可以在 PA 就是可以去做一个搜查，呃，就是 search 去搜查，啊，他会告诉就怎么做。Then I just shared a link with everyone. It's corporations.pa.gov. Where you can search, you can put in your business、uh, name, and you can search to see if you have filed any documents with the state. And then you can, for three dollars, you can download a copy. Okay, he just said, "Uh, he just shared the link with everyone, so I think you can see it, right?" Yes. Ah, he just said, "You can go to the website and find out some of your restaurants." Okay. Ah, so you said, "Like, enter the name, and then、um, it will show up." Right. If you enter the name of your business.、Yeah. Okay. 对，然后他就是说，你可以三块钱可以下载这个文件。You can if you if you don't have entity docs, but you have like a business license, you can use that as well. 他说，如果你没有这个 entity doc， 可是你有 business license， 就是商业的牌照，你用这一个用商业牌照也是可以的。Um. All right. Oh yes.、Um, I think that answers that question. Another question we had was、um, let me just pull this up.、Uh, there was a question regarding、um, uh, if there's any recommendations on how to choose the correct best CDFI to apply for.、Uh, maybe you can speak for a second on that. Yeah, great question.、Um, uh, so. The application is exactly the same. The application, the the process.、Um, so the way it works, once you apply, regardless of which organization you apply through, the application is the same, and then it initially gets reviewed for eligibility by Lendistry, and then if if the application is from an eligible business. Then it is reviewed by a committee that is made up of leaders from various organizations. Okay. 
就是有一个问题说有怎么多的CDFI的款应该是有什么建议是应该选哪一个去申请 so it, it really doesn't make any difference. The only um, difference it makes is if you already have a relationship with one of the organizations, okay, then it would make sense to apply through that organization. Okay,他说所有申请表,不管你哪一个CDFI的申请表都是一样的,okay,没有什么大区别的,可是就是如果你是跟哪一个CDFI有这个关系的话,okay,就是有联系的话,你就可以去找这个机构。Yeah, okay. I think that answers that question. Yeah. Mm-hmm. So, um, there was another question regarding just the funding that the CDFI has received in general from the VA state. Um, but one of the questions is how is the $225 million allocated to the 18 CDFIs? Yeah, um, great question. So there, um, there was $225 million that was put into this program. Um, and the way it's, it's not being allocated to, to any individual CDFI, the way it's working is um, all 18 CDFIs um, came together and formed the Pennsylvania CDFI network. And um, that uh, among those, those 18 CDFIs and the, the PA uh, CDFI network, we organized various committees um, to put together this application, to work with Lendistry, to review, there's a committee to review applications. And then um, all of the money is, is going out through uh, the Pennsylvania CDFI network. It's not being allocated in separate amounts to separate CDFIs. Okay. Um, so it's, like I said, regardless of which CDFI you apply to, um, it's all handled the same way. So just want to make sure, so it, no matter which CDFI they're applying, okay, all these money are coming from one part. That's so, correct. Okay, yeah. yeah. 这里有一个问题就是说这零点二五一的钱是怎么分配到十八个CDFI? Okay, Brian就是说其实没有说分配, okay, 还是全包这个一的全包聚在一起的, Okay, 他们认为他们就是基本上, 他们所有的CDFI就是聚在一起, 就是做了一个叫宾州的CDFI的网络, Okay, 这个网络里边它有不同的委员会, 然后他们聚在一起之后就去想这些钱怎么分,这个申请表应该是怎么样, 这个申请情绪是怎么样, 又说可以了, 这个计划可以行了, 然后就是让他们十八个去协助, 这个申请情绪, OK, 所以这些钱不是说分居到哪一个, 哪一个CDFI的. Right, and I would just also add that um, we are making sure, so it's, it's, we're making sure that some grants go to all counties in Pennsylvania. And then if you, you'll see on the um, website uh, we, we sh- looked at earlier, there's priority given to certain um, types of businesses and um, areas where uh, to help ensure that the grant and that the, the money is going to areas where it is most needed. Okay. 他就是说,在刚才有个网站上面有说,可能有某些绿营的这个商业还是某些地区的话,可能有一些优先的,因为三文想确保就是需要这些钱可以分配到被需要的商业还有地区。Let me add one more important piece. Um, the first round of applications is open until July 14th. And we are, we're only going to give out so much money in the first round. We're setting some of the monies aside so that we have a second round and possibly additional rounds as well. If you are not approved 
this first time in, in the first round, your application will automatically be um, reviewed again in the second round. And you do not need to apply again. There's nothing else that you need to do. It will just automatically be considered again in the second round. Okay. This is good to know, but that's also my next question. Okay, he just to add one thing. Okay, because they, um, they in the first round, they only accept not many, okay, ah, uh, limited, okay. So they actually have some money that they put in the back is ready to use in the second round. So if you the first round, they don't accept your application, they will put it in the second round. 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 Um, but are not selected in the first round, they will automatically be considered in the second round. Okay, 就是说不需要重新申请，就是因为你第一轮的话自动放到第二轮啊，因为你是合资格了。So I want to know, so okay, so is there a limit on number of application on the first round, or、uh, how can someone not being approved when they eligible? Yeah, so the way it will work is.、Um, For all the eligible applications, they will be reviewed by a committee made up of leaders from the 18 CDFIs, and the applications will be scored、um, based on various、um, the priority criteria,、um, and that is published on the the PA、um, that that grants website we looked at earlier, and then.、Um, The applications that score the highest, according to those、uh, priorities, will be awarded the grants. Okay, 我刚才就是问他说，如果合资格的 ，OK， 可是。啊、uh, ，就是没有批的。我说为什么没有批了？他就是说啊，因为他啊，就是所有申请表一个合资格的话，就会被十八个这个 CDFI 的啊领袖，就是去重新再看，然后每一个申请表有一个分数。OK， 然后有的啊，就是足够分数的话，他们就会先批。OK， 所以如果分数不够的，就是放到第二轮。Will people have a chance to uh? I'm gonna take a. I'm gonna take.、Yes. You, I think you have more questions than the. Yeah, it's just drawing out more.、Questions. I'm going、yeah. to pause you because I have. I see Chan has had his hand raised for a while. I'm going to have him ask his question, and then we'll go back to the chat room. Okay. 就是说，现在先让啊，有一个举手的，让他先问。Okay. 然后我们再看聊天里边的。啊 ，But I, maybe I just want to know, ah, how long can Brian stay? Because we are like travel for right now. Okay. You say, how long can I stay? Yes. Oh yes. I um, thanks for asking. I as long as you need me to answer questions, I'm happy to. Yeah, let's keep this going. If, if so, I may, we will stop at the question at that twelve o four. The last question is from Alisa Chan, so we will stop it right there. I、okay. agree. Okay, so yeah, yes.、Yeah, yeah. yeah. Thank you so much, Brian. Yeah, um, Chan, uh, you can, you can speak. Okay. Uh, Chan, Chan, now, 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 Chan, 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 you raise your hand. Can you ask a question? Um, so I think we're gonna go back to the chat room now. The next question is. Um, it, once they apply,、uh, roughly how long will it take for them to get the grant? So、um, we will continue taking applications until the end of July fourteenth, and at that time,、um, the applications will will Lendistry will finish doing the initial eligibility screening, and then they will be reviewed and scored、uh, by the committee.、Um, uh, And then the the awards will be announced.、Um, I anticipate it being the end by the end of July, so about ten to fourteen days 
after the first round closes. So you said um, it will that they will approve or the funding will be in the bank? Um, that they will approve and then the funding will only take um, it's only a day it's it's only a day or two. Yeah, okay. I, I think that um, they will probably have an answer and have the funding, I'm guessing by the end of the month or very shortly after. Okay. 啊，这个问题就是说 ，OK， 生产之后大概多少会收到这些钱 ？OK， 啊、呃，他就是说，他们现在还没啊、呃，就是还在接收申请，然后七月十四号啊、呃、终止了之后，他们就是应该这个 Lander Street 就会知道有哪些申请是合资格的，然后就会发到这个是委员会里边去审理，审理大概要十到十四天，所以大概可能是。啊，七月尾吧，七月尾的时候，他们应该是有可以说这个申请批还是不批，然后钱通常就是大概一两天应该可以打进银行里边。Okay, sounds good. Um, thank you for that. And then just to recap, um, businesses that have a revenue of over one million dollars, they are ineligible for this application, correct? That is correct. Because the the grant is really focused on the smaller businesses. Ah, 对有一个对对有一个问题问这个 one million 的话是不是可以申请？刚才已经说了，这个是啊没办法申请的。Um, okay, and then there's another question. I'm not、uh, maybe Ping, you can help me understand. The question was, can we apply、uh, for this grant? 啊，然后上后头写的公司成立了，公司成立吗？啊，啊 ，Can you do you understand？ 啊，呃 ，eleven fifty six。哦，公司成立。啊，周安，你是问这个是呃，你是不是问是想开公司啊？啊，对，因为现在也呃，因为难找工作，所以呃，没有呃积累资金嘛，所以如果有可以扶助资金，可以成立新公司的这种。可不可以申请他的这个项目的分类 ？So Brian, I think that, uh, well, I think she's asking is can this grant, I mean, for people that can't find a job right now, maybe they want to start their own business. So can this grant be used for that? So this grant cannot be used to start a business. Um, the business must be have already been open prior to, I think it's prior to February fifteenth. Yes. I don't have the date on me,、um, and so it needs to already be open and generating revenue prior to February fifteenth. Okay. Ah,、uh, 对，他就是说是没办法。如果你是这个是必须要在二月十五号之前已经开了，然后有可能是有这些啊、uh, 交易的话才可以。But、uh, Brian, I think、uh, entrepreneur work, as she said, you guys do provide support for people that、um, do business, right? Yes, that is right. Yes.、Okay. We provide、um, a lot of training for people who are starting businesses, and we also provide business loans、uh, up to fifteen thousand for a new business. Okay. Ah,、uh, Joanne, 他就是说啊，我刚才就是说 ，entrepreneur work 不是只是做这个啊，挣款，他也是有帮忙。就是因为你是想就开新新公司，他有一些训练，然后他也有贷款是啊，一万五千块以下了都可以有贷款的。Okay. Okay. Uh, let me next questions. Uh, yeah. So the so the next question after that, which um, the、uh, which Brian just kind of touched on as well, is the question if businesses can apply without revenue. So, uh, I right, right and that would be the, the, I don't have the information in front of me, but I I think you need to have been generating at least some revenue prior to February fifth. Uh, fifteen. Okay. 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 Will there be any?、Uh, will and will folks get any notifications when their application gets rolled over to the second round? 
Yes. So um, if you apply in the first round, at the end of the round, there will be various uh, emails going out. You'll get an email saying that the applications are closed and it'll give you the status of your application. And then um, if you do not, if you're not awarded the grant, you will get notification that your application um, will be reviewed in the second round. 这个问题就是说，如果是申请机动区第二第二轮的话，有没有通知？他就是说会的，会有通知。But uh, Ryan, right, let me just jump in. Like when we talk about notification, is it gonna be email or mail or phone call? Just want to clarify because most of our clients are limited LEP, so it would be good that they know where that communication coming from. Yes. So um, I know it would be coming through email. I don't know, I do not think it'll be a phone call and there will not be any mail communication. It will be email um, and they may also receive some text communication if they opt in for the text messaging. Okay, so if so I think you, before you mentioned if the application has some questions, right? If there's incomplete or um, so, um, there's people gonna contact the applicants for to verify. So would that be full phone call or do you know how that's gonna work? Yeah, so if the application is incomplete, they will get an email um, letting them know that there are still some documents that are needed or letting them know that it's incomplete. But then they will also receive a phone call mm -hmm. from a team member at Lendistry mm -hmm. to gather additional information. Will they have interpretations? Um, unfortunately, I do not think they do. Okay. 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 我刚才就是问他，因为说通知的话，这个通知是什么？通知是email电话还是啊邮寄？啊，Brian就是说啊，就是通知去第二轮的话，通常都是email。如果你的申请是有什么问题不完整的话 uh, we are going on to our last question. Um, so uh, there was a question regarding if they can apply for this fund, if they had already applied for SBA, CPP, and IDLE, I assume, um, which you did mention in the beginning, but if you would uh, mind just uh, reiterating that. Yeah, so if you've, if you've received the PPP or IDLE or other, like the grant from, from the city of Philadelphia, um, you are still eligible and definitely encouraged to still apply for this grant. Um, just make sure you report on the application how much money you've received from these other resources. And um, uh, make sure that you're not, for example, if you use the PPP to cover payroll, but then you, you're gonna also use this grant to cover payroll for the same time. Um, that would be like, like double dipping, or um, yeah, you can't you can't use the money twice. Okay. Uh, this question is about applying. Uh, if there are other PPP idols or other grants, can you apply for one? He says, "I encourage you to apply for one. Just when you fill out your application, if you have any questions, you can ask him. If you have any other grants, then how much grants? If you are using PPP to cover payroll, that is, the wages of the employees, you can apply for one. It is not possible to use for the same amount of money. Okay, it is not possible to use for the same amount of money. Do you want me to just summarize the answers to these other questions? Yeah, if you can do it really quickly. Yeah, so this is a grant. It does not need to be paid back. We're encouraging everyone to document how the money is used, just in case your business was, would be audited. But it is a grant. You do not need to pay it back. Um, there is no minimum revenue requirement. So if you're a very small business and you don't have much revenue, you're still encouraged to apply. And if the business is located in a different state, um, as long as you're doing more than 51% of your business in Pennsylvania, 
and you filed um, taxes with the state of Pennsylvania, you should be eligible to apply. Okay. Uh, 就是说, 第一, 他说这一个是正款来的, 不需要付委屈的, 钱给你了, 就不用付委屈, 可是他们还是建议你, 然后他是没有最低的这个赚钱的收入 okay, Minimum revenue requirement是没有的 okay? 然后如果你是在其他州的话 你必须要在PA 里边有赚到51%的收入 okay? 然后你也要有报这个PA的税 okay? PA就税 okay? um, I think that's uh, yeah. Yeah. yeah I think we're good to go um, So Thank you very much, Brian, for taking time to be so helpful.